bro. Yo. What's up, bro? How you doing? Oh, pretty good. Just chilling. Yeah. What about you? Dang, good. How'd you know you had Rona, bro? I, uh, my son's test positive. He gave me a number at my house. Oh, shit. So, yeah, I had to go test it. <laughs> but do you feel sick at all? No, I've just had a stuffy nose this whole time. That's it. Like, I was like, hey, man, like, I was like, what's Dorian been up to? I'm gonna hit him up so he could have some lunch or something or hang out. And then uh, he's like, bro, you know he's got Rona. <laughs> I was like, what? So, hey, bro, go outside. I got you a little care package, bro. What's up? Yeah, I got you a little care package, bro. For real? Yeah, bro. What? You here? Yeah, bro. Yeah, I just left it on your doorstep. <laughs> Yo! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. Don't start dancing, bro. Huh? Don't start dancing. <laughs> What's up, hey, yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, because... And a problem, yeah, cause my girl got it. She got it last. So we were back month. in the crib, and you guys just see me pull up to my boy's crib, man. And we had to leave him a little care package to my boy Dorian. Shout out to you, bro. Glad you're doing okay, and glad you didn't get crazy symptoms. But I gotta show you guys the two sneakers that we picked up while we were down there. It's like an hour away from my hometown, and we went, and my boy hooked it up. He sold me these two shoes. One of them is a sold out sneaker. The other one is an unreleased sneaker. So let's get into them real quick, and let me show you guys what I picked up. First off, we got this box right here and you guys already know it's like that fearless box that dropped last year uh, with all the fearless pack and they're still doing this for the ladies this is in a size 10 and a half size 9 men's my boy did hit on these for retail on the sneakers app I uh, got the lid right here and these are going to be the green pair uh, the Heineken or Hanneken Whatever you call these things, that's what these are, the Heineken pair. I think it's a very nice sneaker. I don't know if this thing will do big numbers on the resale market only because it is a woman's sneaker. And you guys know that a lot of these shoes aren't doing big numbers. Uh, for some reason, people just don't want to go out and pay for the woman's shoe. They rather they would go pay for the men's shoe, but since it's a woman's shoe, they stay pretty low on resale value. But nonetheless, I'm happy to have another Jordan 1 in the collection. You guys know my Jordan 1s are crazy. And this next one is a crazy pickup, man. It's an early release. This shoe is not in my size. It's a size too small, but I'm going to try to squeeze my foot in there. Um, and if for some reason, once I'm able to get my own pair, then I don't know, maybe I'll sell these or maybe I'll trade my boy back for my size. But I did want to bring these to the channel and I felt for the price it wasn't bad at all. Picked them both up for a pretty good price. So shout out to my boy Tony for that. Uh, not Tony, not, not Tony D. It's another Tony, Kansas Tony. But anyway, shout out to you, bro. These he hit on the sneakers app as well. And of course, these are the Fire Red 4s. This is a sneaker that I really did want in the collection. Uh, I really wanted these to come back out. I know there's going to be a bunch of flaws on this shoe. This one doesn't have any. It has a little bit of glue stains, but other than that, it doesn't really have any crazy flaws. And you guys have probably be seen so many reviews of so many uh, YouTubers do reviews on these. As you guys do know, uh, the toe box is a little bit different. The shape of the shoe is kind of a vintage type shape to this sneaker and it just looks very nice. We, we just want that vintage look now. So Nike is catching on and they're doing like the midsoles. They're kind of doing the yellow midsoles, the sale midsoles. And now we got this shoe right here that makes uh, the shape of this shoe kind of makes it look like it was sitting for 10 years and we finally opened it up and decided to wear it. The shoe is cool in itself. It does have the hang tag right here. I kind of miss the little jump man, uh, a little more of a, a sturdier hang tag that I used to have. It was, you know, but they did actually give us this hang tag that we got on the breads. I think the breads have the same hang tags that this one has. I want at least a couple of these. So if you guys hit on a nine, I at least want two pairs of these in the collection. At least, at least, at the very least, two pairs because I know how fast Jordan 4s wear down. I wear a lot of my Jordan 4s, guys. My Travis Scotts, I've worn them a bunch of times. My my uh, Thunders, uh, and, and they all crack on the midsole, man. Once you wear them a lot, they all crack in the midsole. So I want to preserve my fire reds because it is an all white shoe. Uh, even my pure monies that I do have in the collection, I've only worn one time and I wanna preserve those so I could be able to rock them later on. I know it's kind of crazy, but with me having so many sneakers, it's easy to do to preserve my shoes. So I do need a couple pairs of these in my collection. Let me know how many pairs you guys will be picking up because I know a lot of people will be doubling up. I need two for the feet. I'm sorry, I just need them. I'm not trying to be greedy. I'll be happy with two pairs, but yeah, we're going. I'm gonna try these on. Hopefully these things fit pretty good. Uh, if they don't, then maybe I could trade my boy for a size nine if he hits on a size nine. 
I do not believe that resale is going to be anything crazy on these. I do believe they're going to be major, um, a major GR. Therefore, you guys should be able to get your hands on them. They are going to retail at $200. Uh, and after tax, you're probably paying like maybe $217 out the door. The shoe is very nice. I love it. I love this sneaker. Let me know what you guys think about this quick little pickup video. Um, I was really wanting to record the whole thing. I was going to record the whole thing, me going over there, meeting with the boy, picking these up. And I completely forgot me being the sneakerhead that I am. We went down there and I was just more excited for the sneakers than I was for the content. Um, I apologize 100%. After I got done buying them, my boy's like, bro, weren't you going to record this? And yeah. And even my girl told me, like, weren't you going to record this? And I was like, yeah, I forgot all about it. Like, sometimes I just forget. Uh, shout out to my buddy, Dorian. Hopefully, you get better, bro. And I appreciate all you guys that are new to the channel. Please hit the subscribe button. We're a little bit slow on the subscribers. And that's fine with me. I really don't care. But if you do like the content, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Hit the share button. Hit the like button. Uh, and that's it, man. I really do appreciate you guys tuning in to my videos. I hope that, you know, I made somewhat of your day with my videos. And it's your boy Jay Hernandez. We'll be on to the next video. I'm out of here. Ladies.